What's up y'all, Tracy here, back with another reaction video. This is something I'm very excited to see. I've been excited to see some gameplay of this game since I watched the cinematic trailer. And everybody who plays video games know the cinematic trailers are insanely deceptive of if the game's gonna be good or not. Because cinematic trailers always look good. Always. Because they're fucking gorgeous graphics and everything and it just makes the game look fucking awesome. But then until you see the gameplay, you can't really tell if the game's good. Until you play, you still can't tell really, but it helps to see the gameplay. This is the official Shadow of War gameplay walkthrough. Hopefully this doesn't spoil too much of the game. It shouldn't. They usually don't spoil too much of the game. I don't usually like to watch too much gameplay before I buy a game because even though I want to check out that the gameplay is good, I also don't want to end up accidentally getting spoiled about anything. So I tend to try and stay away from it. A lot of you guys wanted me to watch this and I really want to see it so we're gonna fucking check this shit out. I've heard good things about it. I'm excited for this fucking game. I really am. Alright so let's check this shit out. Let's see if it's as good as everybody keeps saying it is because a lot of y'all keep telling me this is gonna be a great game and the, f the first game in the series was so I imagine that this could only get better. But yeah here we go. May contain content inappropriate for children. That's the best kind of content. So this is in game. Looks pretty fucking good. In game cinematics always gonna be less. Shadow of War is an epic third person open world action RPG. <laughs> and the sequel to the award-winning Shadow of I love of third Mordor. person too, by the way. This walkthrough takes place many hours into the game, where we will show okay. you one example of the epic personal stories so created this is the next generation of the revolutionary the game. Wow, Nemesis this system. looks so pretty. To save Middle-earth, we will be journeying deep behind enemy lines and using the new ring of power to forge an army and conquer Mordor. Awesome, you guys, I'm already On the so world map, excited for we this. see the many regions we can conquer. Every one of these regions is a distinct environment with unique enemies and allies, including overlords, war chiefs, enemies captains, and allies. followers, fortresses, cool. strongholds, missions, and more. Today, we're going to attack and conquer the mountain valley of Saragost Kay. and take it from Sauron's overlord, Ur Hakan, Aww, so the Dragon cute, Lord. Though. Let's launch the assault. Okay, let's get it. I'm excited. Here we go. It's not only our enemies and the world that make the Nemesis system unique, it's also our followers. Yeah, I was curious about that. Rag Dug the Iron Mount has armored cavalry that can charge through the flames of artillery fire. Hmm. The Demolisher is a living battering ram with the power Aww, to smash cute. enemy defenses. With our followers at our side, we must first face the Stormbringer. The Bright. Ooh, this is cool. I fought for you. Bled for he you. looks cool and though. You left me to die. But I was reborn with the power of the Dark Lord. He looks hella awesome. He has a history and personal grudge against us. He used hmm. to be part of our army before he betrayed us and joined oh. the Dark Lord. He also carries a dark Dick curse bag. which prevents us from using the power of the new ring. Come, charge he looks hella the cool. flames of your reckoning. Ignite. The Overlord has deployed hmm. multiple fort defenses including siege beasts and flame archers. Okay. No more <laughs> He's so cute. There we go. War. So this is all in game. First objective nice. will be to break through the main gate. Wow, this looks like fun. This already looks hella fun. And you got this. Yeah, this is gorgeous. <laughs> He's like smash. Yes! Platforming. I suck at 
suck at it sometimes, but it's fun as fuck. That's that's cool. As nice. Ooh, cutting heads off. Uh -oh. You feel it, don't you? This is the power Ooh. of the dark lord. I wonder if you can turn evil. I'd really love to turn evil. Yes. Murdering everybody. Nice. Super, super delicious. And can unleash our power as the okay. demolisher breaches the gate, allowing our army to storm the fort. I'm digging this. I'm digging this. I'll have to play it firsthand, but I like how this is set up. Ooh. Ouch! Quite the headache you got. Yes! I love the combat. Giving me all these Assassin's Creed feels. I I can't wait for the new Assassin's Creed. This looks fucking awesome. <laughs> Roll over that bastard. This is so cool looking. Hell yeah. Get up there. You got this shit. Go. There are many ways to conquer a fort. Okay. From open combat to stealth and infiltration. Yes. I mean, I'll probably open combat, but I might use stealth sometimes. I'm not very good at stealth. It's the bane of my existence trying to be stealthy. Ooh. That's cool. We've infiltrated a spy within the enemy ranks. This looks so fucking good. Dead Eye has placed explosives, allowing us to sabotage I'm the wall excited. and outflank the defenders. Seriously, is giving me so many assassins pre feels. All breached. Also able to help clear the way by sniping enemies. Nice. In Shadow of Mordor, the Nemesis system created memorable stories of bloodshed and revenge. Mm -hmm. In Shadow of War, your followers can create entirely new stories of loyalty, betrayal, rivalry, and even friendship. Cool! Fuck yeah! That sounds 10,000 times better. That's awesome. What about romance? Thanks, Deadeye. <laughs> Nice shot. We've expanded the RPG systems in Shadow of War enormously. Okay. Defeating Stormbringer allows us to collect this epic armor of Rohan and equip it. Yes! Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. I'm so excited for this game. This is, this is gonna be good, you guys. Ranger! Aww. Good <laughs> Stormbringer? He's so dramatic. Yours, mine. And you've stolen my tail. Oops. <laughs> Man, I like him. He's funny. It's time to dance! <laughs> it's time to dance! <laughs> Shit. No! That doesn't look good. It looks like acid. It's gonna blow up. No! Oh. 
Mounting our awesome. allows us to ride through these waves unharmed. That's so cool. And I mean, some of this is similar stuff, but still so cool. Yes! Releasing and dominating the Drake lets us turn the Overlord's defenses against Hell yeah, you can ride dragons! I don't know, she said Drake. But I'll say dragon. This is cool. This is fucking awesome. I don't know. I might be very bad at this game because I just suck sometimes at strategizing and stuff, but and I'll be live streaming it. So it'll be harder to concentrate. But I I'm excited to play. Ooh. Bitch slapped him. I like when you cut the heads off. You've terrified the flame of war. <laughs> now bend him to your will. He's scared. The ring of power allows us to dominate cool. the minds of our enemies. I am your Compelling them Hell to join yeah. our growing army. Now with the power of the new That's ring fucking awesome. and the help of our followers, we've defeated the Guys, I'm launches. getting really excited. Man, my panties are wet. I'm so excited. Okay, it's time to happen. The main event. We can face our ultimate nemesis in this fort, the Dragon Lord himself. It's time to take what is ours. With the Nemesis system, every overlord this faced by every player will be well. unique to their world. And the throne room itself has been customized by the overlord oh. as his personal combat arena. Every environment personalized to the king. That's awesome! It's the Lord of Mordor himself! It really is. That's really the fucking cool. It's what I look for in the game. Being able to You've change made shit. Right mess, and affect stories. My army slain. My Drake dead. So much pain. Yeah, well. I know a thing or two. Had to happen, buddy. Pain. He is cool looking. And yours. It's going to burn a hole into this world. Well, shit. This is gonna be intense. Hell yeah! Slid underneath his legs. Ooh, right in the penis. Yeah. Ooh, cut your leg off! Ugh. Damn, the gore, it's delicious! Getting a gore boner. Yes! Murder that bastard! Damn, that looks painful. Flipping over people. Wow. That would hurt so bad. I know you'd probably die pretty fast. How it's done. This might hurt. This might hurt. Greg Doug Iron Mount. Oh no! 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 Poor guy got his back broken. Zagos is mine! With the overlord Dang. defeated, Fort that was Saragos, awesome. and this region of Mordor. Are ours. Hell yeah! What happens when it becomes ours? 
do we get to make it pretty? The region rewards us with experience, loot, new followers, and resources. Hell yeah. It also creates a personal base from which we train our forces, yes! increase our power, and upgrade our defenses against Sauron's counterattacks. Awesome. Let's return to the army screen, where we can review our enemies and command our followers. We need to select one to become the new overlord, so he oh. can spread his influence so throughout the region. So we get to pick who's the overlord. Creating an entirely original nemesis fortress. That's cool. This war chief is a necromancer. Yeah, I he love He will shroud the fort in sorcery to confuse and terrify attackers. This war chief is a beast master. I'd pick the necromancer. He will allow us to turn the creatures of Mordor against our enemies. But we're going to promote Rag Dug, the war chief who charged through mm -hmm. that artillery assault yeah. and helped us bring down Ordo. I can see why you would pick him. As a marauder, he can loot and pillage the region for us. Awesome! This is cool as shit. With our new overlord in place, we can upgrade Hell the yeah. fortress. Upgrade it! Defenses, yes! And enlarging the size and power of our army. Can you make it look pretty? I hope so. The Nemesis system this means is that so every element of this mission awesome. is dynamic and unique. Yeah, you can no change two it up. players of the game will experience the same story. We will that's the coolest thing I ever. Like, this that's is what just I look one step for in, in our games. conquest of Mordor. One small example of the millions of unique stories players like will that. create I like in Middle it. Earth Shadow of War. I like it a lot. Hell yeah. Unique choices is something I always look for in games. Sometimes they lie, sometimes they make it seem like they're gonna be unique and they aren't really that unique. But For I have hope. Right, Lord. Forge your army. Hell yeah, pre-order today for legendary or available August 22nd. Hell yeah! All right, that was official Shadow of War gameplay walkthrough. That was fucking amazing. Okay, you guys, like, as an RPG fan, one of the best things in RPGs is if you can change the storyline or if you can affect the story with your choices. That's something I look for all the time whenever I'm gaming. So it's so cool to think, like, you could have so many different options and that every single person's story and everything is going to be different. I wonder how much of it is story. I hope there's a lot of story in it, not just fighting. But I actually really enjoy that conquering mentality and taking over the world and fucking making a cool base and putting people in charge. I really love doing that shit, so I'm excited for this. I didn't see a PlayStation 4... Thing. I'm worried about that, but August is a ways away. It's only April, so hopefully I can have my gaming PC by then. That would be great, because then I don't have to worry about it. I can record it on there, so that would be that would be ideal. Or if they have it on PlayStation 4, which hopefully they will. Didn't see it, though. So, I don't know. I'm not getting an Xbox, but I am going to get a gaming PC. All right. Thank you guys so fucking much for watching. I love you guys. You are the best subscribers I could ever ask for. What did you guys think of that trailer? Are you guys excited for this game? You guys excited to see me play this game? Is this something you guys want to see? I'm probably going to play it no matter what, so let's do it. I'm excited to see other people's playthroughs as well after I play because then I can see all the different unique things or I could replay it, you know, a different way. And that would be really cool. But yeah, I am excited. That looked fucking awesome. Thank you guys for sending that to me and telling me to check it out and insisting that it's fucking great because it really looks good. Like, really good. Like, comment, subscribe, share, etc, etc. Peace out!